This is Mansion of Hidden Souls, played by Mad Maddie for longplays.org on the Cube 65 account. A mega CD game this time? I think so. I, I think they might have a couple good ones. Is this one of them? I don't know. I feel like I've actually played this before, but that is also not frame rate issues on the emulator's part. Look! A butterfly! Wow! Look how it just floats in the air. Like a so butterfly. Angry. So beautiful. Hey, let's follow it to see where it goes. Maybe it'll oh, these kids are really fucking bored. <laughs> no way! We better go home or we'll be in big trouble. Besides, Grandma told us never to go anywhere near the elm tree. Alright, so this is a setup for crappy fatal frame, I take there. it. And that they turn us into butterflies if we stare at one long enough. Wow, your grandma hates you. <laughs> she really went into detail. If you don't look both ways before crossing the street, the Grim Reaper will tear your face off. Hey, wait! No! Well, how far could she be running? That's a slow butterfly. Alright, this, um... Now let's... Chug along after that butterfly. <laughs> so, sort of in the style of Return to Zork, this is, I think, all like pre rendered CG kind of things. Um, so, let me tell you a bit about the Sega CD's color palette. They can do green, I can tell you that much. Yeah. They can do green. Oh, wow. Mm. Moon's looking a little off today. <laughs> Yeah. A little jagged. A little bit. Oh my Christ. Yeah, so, um... I'm sure this looked great on Source, but on the Sega CD, uh... 64 colors to work with. Well, let's dive straight into the Mansion of Hidden Souls. Alright, let's do it. I noticed they trademarked the name because they were really into the Mansion of Hidden Souls series, but I, I don't... Where really... am I? How can this be? There was no mansion here before. I'm loving the acting already. Oh yeah, no, it's great. That's a little kid, allegedly, too. A little kid at the age of 28. Quick, they're over here! This is the Resident Evil mansion, right? It looks it. I'll be a bit more pixely, and that's hard to achieve. <laughs> I feel like I need to get my eyes checked just looking at this. <laughs> I know, it kind of hurts. Oh god, fun game from the viewers. If, you, if any of you need prescription glasses, <laughs> take them off and just tell me what this is like to look at. <laughs> this but blurry. Uh, so is this a puzzle, or...? That was just a very ominous stare into the fireplace. Okay. Well, no, my my sister's not here, strangely. I, I guess my search is over. Is that my sister? No. What about that one? Oh, we're not gonna look at the other girls. I guess she's our favorite. Damn it! Well, I guess I can't hang out here with all my preteen friends after all. Well, Ooh. Okay. That's... This is interesting. I hope we get to sit and read the diary. I'm hoping so, too. Wh all right. What the fuck was that? That is the shittiest diary. Okay. <laughs> Dear diary, one. That is my favorite number. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what to write in here. Well, numbers will do. Maybe shapes tomorrow. Okay, so... So far, every single sound effect in this game has annoyed me. <laughs> yeah, the left-right on stereo, I'm sure, seemed like a cool idea, but maybe after five seconds of actually listening to it, they, might, they could have scrapped it? <laughs> we just <laughs> donked our heads! No! I think our character's what? very drunk right now. <laughs> uh, oh, shit. It's unreliable narrator, he really did get into the liquor cabinet. Downstairs. Do it. Bang your head. He didn't actually open the door with his hand, he just used his face. It's unusual that we have two guests in one evening. 
Oh shit, I did play this game. It's a house full of talking butterflies. You must be the brother of the little girl visiting here just a while ago. You have no business here. You do not have the same intention as that of your sister. This Russian butterfly. Or close approximation. Um... Is this supposed to be whimsical? Or I... unsettling? Or... It's definitely unsettling. I don't know if that, that was the intention, but it certainly is that. Oh man, I could do with those. It just starts drinking all of them. <laughs> I'm hearing fucking talking butterflies again. Maybe this is a metaphor for the temptations of alcohol. And how our character has clearly succumbed to them. Did you hear that? That was the voice of your sister. You want to see her? <laughs> I don't think so. That was a... <laughs> our sister's just actually very unattractive. She's not, not much to look at. <laughs> at least by butterfly standards. Oh, is, is this a puzzle or just... A terribly drawn dart bow. Okay, I guess it is. Oh man, I'd love if they somehow programmed in a game of darts or a game of cards with these graphics and the, this uh, interactivity. <laughs> so, this is a game? Maybe it's interactive. It's interactive fiction, maybe. Oh. It is the heavy rain of its time. I see. Wait, did we. Oh, we're. No. No, that was just a magic painting. Okay, well, good. We're behind the bar, so maybe now in... No. Back into the foyer! Okay! The first game I've talked to a butterfly and been sort of bored by, but alright. So... Okay, yeah, that, that footstep sound has got to stop, I'm sorry. Also the ticking clock that... Oh, get out of this foyer, Jesus. They should have called this Headache the Game. Oh, <laughs> oh God, my eyes! Well... I didn't need my retinas, I'm sure. Hey kids, buy Barbie's Mansion of Hidden Souls! Who's there? Ah, we have a new guest. Welcome. It's the same butterfly, don't can't fool me. Well, most butterflies do look the same, you know. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Most of the humans that wander into this mansion become butterflies. So the goal of this game is, don't be a butterfly. Right. Ah, so that, that seems... seems good. I think the liquor will probably help with that. What? Alright, how are we supposed to know <laughs> that was there at all? You found it! How can this be? Good question. I refuse to show you which door it opens. <laughs> <laughs> what an evil butterfly. I'm only gonna walk you halfway there, I'm sorry. The rest you'll have to do on your own. Don't you think it a little impolite to search a lady's room? You're just giving me shit. You're a butterfly. Why do I... Why am I listening to you? I feel like this is the pre-rendered scene where I'd go to the rest of the people at the company, like, maybe we shouldn't make this game. When we're in the Barbie room and the butterfly's yelling at us, you know. <laughs> yeah, I mean... Oh, there was another room there? I mean, given the fact that we just found a key under a random chair, we might as well just start tipping furniture. We'll find all sorts of shit. Maybe some spare change. I feel like a dog got into a Crayola box and threw up all over that room. A pink dog. A pink dog, right. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I keep doing that. <laughs> Forgetting how doors work. And then he shoves his face in even on the pole doors. Do I sense a guest? Oh, more butterflies. Okay. Gotta knock it off with this shit, Mansion of Hidden Souls. I'm starting to think you're getting a bit samey, Mansion of Hidden Souls. <laughs> I can't even tell what that's supposed to be. Were those plates, or...? It's kind of hard to gauge what anything is. What a surprise! Why are you here? Do you want to become a butterfly, too? No. No, that is our main objective in the game, is to be not a butterfly. We figured that out, honestly. Maybe we are a butterfly already and this is how they see. In which case, I feel bad for butterflies. Th that would explain our constant bumping into the door. Huh. I wonder where that came from. I hope it's useful to you. You saw me pick it up. <laughs> You're, you were right there. 
We don't have to speak about it abstractly, either. It's a key. You must know what they do. I mean, you live in a mansion. These butterflies are the worst hosts. Can you imagine a dinner party with these butterflies? I actually cannot. It's like, ooh, we've prepared you dinner, but where is it? <laughs> what is this picture? <laughs> what is it's... this picture? What? Huh? What? Wait, how did that... Uh... Welcome to the moon room. Oh, the trapdoor picture. I should have known. The kid lights a cigarette off one of the candles. He clearly needs one. I would. I don't blame him. Oh, that's the candle you had to blow out to escape, of course. Who are you? Oh, this is the disturbing butterfly. We weren't supposed to see his room. Here are my victims. So you like the butterfly collections here? I collected them all when they were ugly human figures. You gonna commit to that accent or not? We're just gonna stare at the dead, but this is really morbid now. <laughs> yeah, that's... You, you understand what you are, Butterfly, right? And what this room is, and... I'm Butterfly Hannibal. Okay. <laughs> is that a syringe? What do you think? They're gorgeous, ain't they? I think the butterflies as beautiful as the soul. We don't fucking talk like that. <laughs> On behalf of Mansion of Hidden Souls, I apologize. Why don't you become a butterfly and lose that ugly human form? This is Mary Poppins' butterfly room. <laughs> Joy good show! Maybe there's a key in the boot of a car, that's what we call it. I'm sorry, Hori, I can't read these lines anymore. <laughs> Match the shapes of the rooms no longer open. The night with the darkness, the day with the light. Return the original figure, and with the light, you will find what you're looking for. Oh, those are the candles, I think, from a top view. Just close out more slowly, if we could. Thank you. What are you doing here? Oh, you just... If you're here to become a butterfly... A <laughs> butterfly? <laughs> Is that what we are? <laughs> I think, I feel like apologizing to Australians, too. I'm really not sure <laughs> what the actor's going for on that one. I think this, this butterfly's voice is going on a world tour. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what do you know? Another key. We haven't found enough of those in this game. Oh, I see you found the key to this room. Don't think I hid it from you. It must have been a mischievous soul. It's <laughs> <laughs> Mischievous? <laughs> this is... There's a little bit of southern twang, too. And now we bring diabetes into the mix as well. <laughs> All right. Good talk, Butterfly! Get the hell out of this room! God damn, I can't wait for the rest of the UN to come in Butterfly form. I, after that, I'm sorry, just forget the sister. Let's just get the hell out of here. Maybe this game is a metaphor for, like, world unity, world peace, multiculturalism. Banging your face into things. Drunkness and also butterflies. <laughs> Young man, what are you doing here? Oh god, <laughs> here's the southern North America. I see? So what, what during all of this has been our goal outside of find key open door? Has there been any other puzzle? We're supposed to find our sister who may be a butterfly by now or... We have to stop her from becoming one while not becoming one ourselves, or something? Are you surprised that a butterfly can talk to you? Believe it or not, I was once a human myself. Just as all the butterflies... Okay, I think the plot of the game has been explained. We understand what's happening now. <laughs> thank, thank you, Blanche Devereaux the Butterfly. If you wandered into this mansion by mistake, you had better get out quickly. Oh, you will be captured by the hunter who will turn you into a butterfly. All right, thank you. Oh, we may be we may be having a final boss of this game, I guess. Is there a button to swat away these fucking talkative butterflies? 
Do you want to become a butterfly? Shut up! Do I have to just talk everyone's ear off when I'm a butterfly? Because I don't think I have the energy. We get it. Have I yet explained the transformation into butterfly? Like, yes! I remember when I was human. I was on a small stage together with my friends and I played the piano. Now I cannot even touch the keys. Don't worry, I'll play the piano for you and just starts headbutting it. <laughs> so at the time I thought it would be wonderful to be like a butterfly, to be carefree. I know now that I made the wrong decision. By the way, have you met that psychotic British butterfly? Yeah, he's got a quite a collection. You should probably stay away from him. Right, yeah. Uh, oh look, a non-key item, our second in the game. Yeah, that was an annoying sound too. That was... Yeah, good. That's how it works. I really hope that had no bearing on anything. <laughs> he just did that for shits and giggles. <laughs> he just shrugs and walks off. Good. This room was absolutely very fruitful. I'm glad we got the key to it. Let me tell you all about being a butterfly. Ding! Walks away. <laughs> I hold on, here's how you can get rid of the hunter bong. Well, okay. Did didn't we already explore this floor? Or is there a puzzle to solve now with the dartboard now that we read that book out of nowhere? Or... Yeah, I think we've seen all the main rooms that you can access from here, so maybe this is where the uh, action portion of the game kicks in. <laughs> right. The rest of this is just explosions. Right. Okay, good. We don't have to talk to this stupid butterfly again. So... You're too young. You oh, God! Le let me get my dartboard! Leave me alone, butterfly! Shoo! I think we should go back to Grandma's, grab a can of Raid, and walk back into here. <laughs> Just wave it around menacingly. Like, you fucking dare talk to me. <laughs> Alright, so that's a clue for the dartboard, so let's solve the stupid puzzle already. No, it's already like that, isn't it? It's not even a puzzle. Oh, oh god! <laughs> Just burn, burn down the house, please. We're good. Game over, don't worry about the sister. Grandma, you were right, she turned into a butterfly the end. She turned into a butterfly and then spontaneously combusted. Oh, is that her voice? I don't think I want to save her anymore. <laughs> we don't even bother yelling after her or anything. It's like, Jonathan, is that you? Whatever. Is there a tuning fork in here? Oh yeah, my brother's a silent protagonist. He ain't gonna call back. <laughs> well, now that we've got the matches, we can go in, drink some wine, and be done with the whole thing. Oh, we could just leave. It's always not... Yeah, yeah we could just leave. Yep. You've got the right, right idea. There. No. Oh. Nah. Damn it. Come on, Mansion of Hidden Souls. Just cop blocking me. <laughs> did someone say Cockney accent? No, no, <laughs> no one did. No, he did not, Jesus. No. Get away. Oh, here's, an here's another, like, butterfly morgue room. What? Is this game trying to be scary now? Because I think it's... I think you've put a little too much into the whimsy, and now the horror is not quite working. It's it's too late, Mansion of Hidden Souls, I'm sorry. Alright, by blowing out this candle... Oh, we have the matches now, so I see, we can... I don't know what... <laughs> we could do something. Oh, we're lighting them in the same order as the darts on the board. Boom, I'm the puzzle master. I am... You are. I am not becoming a butterfly anytime soon. It's a shame, because they could really use someone with a British accent. <laughs> no. like a re I mean, desperately. Oh, yeah, it's like a quote to film. Clearly, that hasn't been met yet. <laughs> I don't think I can use this here. Well, you just did. Though. No. Jonathan. They don't have a joysy butterfly yet, slow beef. <laughs> oh, my God. Well, well, I'm sure the adventure's not quite over yet. Don't... Not... <laughs> hey yo, I'm a butterfly. <laughs> you said you don't want to turn into a butterfly, eh? Hey, watch out for your sister, alright? 
That hunt the guy's a gabagool, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh shit. It's uh well, probably nothing with knowing this game. I'd be scared if I could see what the hell it was. Ah, forget it. <laughs> How about you just leave? <laughs> like, what's keeping you here? Who is keeping you here? I am managing not to turn into a butterfly, so just do whatever it is I'm doing. Somebody's coming! Who said that? Really? He just stares, at the, stares closely at the podium. He's like, what, really? What the fuck is this? <laughs> what? Fucking podiums, am I right? <laughs> it's a little boy. What? How are these flowers casting light, exactly? You're right. It is a little boy. Okay. Now we're going to stare at the last one. A little girl is coming, too. Wait, the flowers talk as well? Is that oh, what? Jeez. It's just nature speaks to us here. It's like I'm the world's really crappiest crazy. Disney cartoon. Oh, and then the talking vase, I guess. It does talk. It just has nothing to say to you. Right. She the magic of the moon. Yeah. Thank you for just systematically speaking to everyone. We need to hear all of this. I am not really aware how this has helped our situation. Oh yes, so beautiful. Somebody's coming. Are these um, flowers even talking about anything? What are they? I. What are they on about? I think this is just unused sound clips that they just threw in here for no reason. Stick them in the flower room. Oh, and now it's the watery scepter room. Oh, a flower, yeah, I haven't seen any of those. Better grab this one. Yeah, but this one doesn't talk to us. It's a rude little bastard. No, don't go... Ah. Oh, God, then you put it in the vase and it talks. Stunning puzzle. Where the? Where is this hunter to kill us already? Wait, no, don't light it on fire. Oh, no, no, do light it on I get a sneaking suspicion this hunter is just going to talk us to death. Oh, and then it becomes came many flowers because we didn't want to animate that. Good. Puzzles. Oh god, there's more. Please, oh, there's another There's another empty podium there. It's going to be more flowers, I reckon. Oh, but we need a vase, too, so... Oh, wait, no, this drained all the water. Clearly. What? Oh, it's a jumping puzzle. Is that platforming? <laughs> I think it is. Hey! Is there gameplay in this game? Right. Well, we've beaten it, I guess, if that's our sister. Yep. We, we done. Good. We can go now.